whichever position my body is in as well. Mm -hmm. So when we're doing this, this like massage, very simple massage to help other people. Uh, the first thing you want to do is make sure that you're, you yourself are very calm mm -hmm. and relaxed. Yeah. You know, place your hands onto their body. Just introduce yourself. So there's a so there's a connection there. And remember, we practice jigong. We're always coming from our center as well. You just make sure you're centered. So I'm introducing myself. And as I'm doing this, I'm engaging. I can see the way his structure is moving. Yeah. Right, so I'm going to start up here. I'm massaging with here. I'm not massaging with the fun. Yeah. So like, as I'm pushing, I can see that he's He's not still hold, hold, holding on. Yeah. It's thoracic re region here. Trapezius. Don't be afraid to come close to them. Make sure it was your centered, didn't it? Yeah. Okay, so now we can really go into this. There's muscle underneath here that you want to push underneath so you separate the scapula. The scapula becomes more loose. Yeah. See the bone here? Some people can't do this because it's so tight. Yeah. But in order to do this, you need to really relax all the muscles around it. So it's a triangle, isn't it? So my body is positioned. It's been very. Uh, that's why practice of qigong and such is very helpful. Is you become very sensitive to the way the person is reacting to your touch. But then you can also become very aware of their structure as well. This one a bit more. Okay. Very tight here. Come to the side here, the pectorals, here as well. Male or female doesn't matter, it's the same, yeah? There's muscle here that's pulling the shoulder forward. 
the hook. It's tender. Tender, yeah. So you sort of gently, you can feel the fibers, you can feel it striated. And you, then you go in deeper. And all you're doing is you're, you're loosening up the fibers, the muscle fibers. how tender it is yeah you don't realize remember at all the time you need to make sure your structure is good because right now I'm, pr I'm practicing it's, there's no difference yeah So I do stuff like this. If I'm moving from my centre, that means he will be moving from my centre. Yeah? That feels different, isn't it? Mm. <laughs> okay, so I'm just going to kill him. When you do this, you will feel that you can see, you can not only see the muscle, but if you use your middle eye, if you get connected, you can feel the muscle. You will know whether or not you're doing it right, you will know. It's be very intuitive. It takes time. <coughs> muscle here as well. There's always like the bulk of the muscle, the, the belly of the muscle that you're trying to loosen up. The muscle, we've got lim ligaments on either side of the muscles that we can help to stretch as well. So we do this, when we prep, massage ourselves, we do very similar movements. When I do this by myself, I hold it here and I turn. Yeah, we do other people, we hold it. Hands we help to stretch this way and also we stretch the op opposite way. But remember all the time I'm doing horse stance, yeah? So remember not to be too forceful, yeah? We're not trying to just break the person, we're just reminding them, just kind of like urging them to go back into themselves. Then there's muscle, the muscles, this bit has a belly, it's a big round thing, you want to get into that. Up here is the ligament, ligament here, muscle here. You massage the muscles, it helps stretch the ligament. Up here though. Muscle here, the belly's here, ligaments here as well, and here's ligament. <coughs> Muscle here, the belly is here, the round part. Help to relax that. Tight. Up here's ligament here. Ligament here to this muscle here. <coughs> Ligament always attached to the bone. Ligament attached to the bone and muscle to the muscle. So I'm get holding here. See that I'm holding onto this, these ligaments here. 
come on, my movement. Look. I don't say still like this. This is wrong. Mm. This is fake movement. Look at my body. Mm. Yeah? In the same little light, I could, if I wanted to, I could break someone's so. mm. <laughs> You can feel it. You can feel it, you know. <laughs> yeah? So look, my whole body, look. So I don't take, I don't take no, 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 um, there's no energy involved. Mm -hmm. Yeah? So the whole start is very important. That means I'm always, I'm always using my whole body to do it. I'm not doing this and going, here, what am I using? Just my shoulder. So if I come down here, what am I using? You can see, you see the difference. Right, so now we can really come into these. Here, yeah, it's more loose now. You can use oil if you want. Right. This one's get really tight. The reason why Joe's really tight here was he's tight down here. Yeah. I, I know that from the beginning when, when, when I was pushed, when I was making contact with him. But you, you have that understanding, the more you have understanding of your own structure. Does that make sense? Because when he's moving, I can feel already that he's moving away from here. Because I'm coming from my center. Yeah? I'm just encouraging blood flow. Yeah. And then now, hands like this. And behind here. Like this. So it's going. This. But make sure you do it from, you know, do it, don't do it from up here. It's gonna, when you do this movement here, you're doing it from here. When I'm doing this movement here, I'm not doing it from up here, I'm doing it from here. Yeah? And then, uh, don't, look, don't be worried about it, look how close I get. Is that okay, Joe? And what I'm massaging here, this area here. Is that okay, Joe? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Hello, I'm just following his. Mm -hmm. There's no force there. Yeah, then I can. Yeah. That feels comfortable, wasn't it? Mm. Yeah. Make sure to keep your structure. Okay, for the next one. So hold, holding, holding him like this. And then. Good, now you're more scared. <laughs> yeah. yeah. 
Yeah. So this position here, what I did is I, I went to the last form in Chico. I held on to it. I remember holding from here. I don't hold on like this. I hold on from here. I mean, what I did was this. I'm lifting, I'm lifting up from the ground upwards. I'm not using my upper torso to pull it. I'm not, I'm not doing this. My whole body is going like this. Yeah? Oh, that feels okay. Mm, yeah, every yeah, now let's do a little. Yeah, I just help to adjust C1 to 3. But we only can really do that after the muscle's been relaxed, you know. If you tried to do that when it's not relaxed, that would have really that would, would have been painful. Okay. Good job, would you like to put your hand place your hands behind your neck? Clasp them together. Yeah. So this one I'm to bring here. So now I'm, I'm asking to breathe in, and I will breathe in as well. Yeah. So as he breathed in, I breathed in as well, and then I did the nail again. You see what I did? Uh, he breathed in, I breathed in, and I'm, that's all I did. Yeah. It was more stable then. Okay, so now we're gonna encourage the body to natural, naturally uh, equilibrate. Making the muscles engage. Ask Joel to push on top. Push, yeah, push, 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 push. Yeah. Okay, so now I'm asking him to push upwards. Yeah. Again, push. Good. Yeah, push. So now here I'm just kind of just massaging his stomach. But this remember this is the dantian. Remember, dantian is where the navel, in between the navel and where the the, uh, the pubic bone is. It's back here. This is the centre of your of your being. This area here. So I'm just massaging it. And I'm once again I'm pushing it, kind of getting it to hold on to its position. Yeah. Glutes to engage. You're gonna be punching hard. If you're doing massage punch, uh, hold it like this. But then now you've got an engage of like how hard you're punching. Mm. But you're holding onto yourself. Mm. That makes sense? Mm -hmm. Even the fight don't do that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. It's here now, I ain't gonna feel no I ain't gonna feel nothing. If I do like this, then yeah, I'm sure it is. I'm reminded to not too too much. A little horse stance. I'm not using no muscle, I'm just from my center, I'm just turning here, my hips are turning. Yeah? Yeah, so what I can see is Joe's tight here. Yeah, but this here is, you, you can't really get massage and get it loosened. Because you get massage and get loose, it'll make you more lazy. People don't realize this. The healing is going to come when you do it yourself and you will get relieve this tension through breathing through allowing your breath to reach all the way down the reason why we get Ill, illness or any uh, illness is for stagnancy the, the, the prana does not always the, 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 we don't breathe all the way down so now this area here is just it becomes stagnant it's not moving this is not like a mm -hmm. it's not like a snake hole you know it's very stiff we always help to alleviate like certain areas here but always the lumbar this area here you need to work on yourself Mm -hmm. Does it make sense? Mm -hmm. Massage ain't gonna do it. Yeah, 
Massage is going to be like if you're king, you could pay for it every day, but the, work, the healing is going to come from yourself doing exercise. But the right exercise, be very aware and connected with your breath. So I'll just recap, um, make sure that when you're moving, you're always moving with your breath. If you, if you are moving without your breath, it's a fake and forced move. It's not real. See one last one, yeah? Let's try that again. You're much more relaxed here now, aren't it? Yeah. Okay, so we helped out today with uh, Joe's tension up here. Yeah? Thank you, all. Beautiful. Um, yeah.